Good day folks, welcome back to another tying video. Uh, tonight we're going to tie up uh, the micro torch. This has been a uh, kind of a bloodworm micro leech hybrid, but um, this spring it's just been killing it for us. Um, so we thought we'd show you how to tie it. Um, I'm going to start with a size 14 curved nymph hook and I've got a 7 uh, gold bead and I'm tying with uh, fluorescent fire orange thread so I'm just going to get the front half of the hook dressed here <clears throat> and first material we will tie in is some fluorescent fire orange um, marabou and Gonna tie this in and behind the bead here and wrap it back. Like so. Just a couple wraps up underneath. Now the next step is kinda up to you, but part of what makes this pattern work is the long tail. And uh, it will foul occasionally if it's too too long so if you want you can just kinda pinch it to, pinch it to length but I like to leave them quite long so um, <clears throat> I'll just leave that there and uh, next material is a micro gel core um, fritz or chenille um, pretty neat stuff I think it's uh, 0 0.05 or 0 0.08 in diameter so just tiny tiny little stuff but works really well and this is uh, available at Canadian Llama and uh, you see it's kind of the key to this pattern so we'll get that tied in at the back and just go ahead and wrap it up the body Just like so. Try not to overlap too, too much. I want to keep it fairly thin. And once you get up to your bead, go ahead and get it tied off. Trim out the excess. And just come right in with a whip finish. And voila, you have it. Very, very simple tie, but of uh, this has got to be in the top two or uh, probably the top performer uh, so far this spring. Just been deadly, so responsible for a couple big fish already. And uh, so that's the micro torch. Give it a tie, fish it. Hopefully, it uh, fishes as good for you as it has for us. And uh, that's all there is to it. Um, thanks very much for uh, watching. Give us a thumbs up if you liked it. Subscribe if you haven't. And until the next one, cheers and tight lines.